Hello everyone and welcome back to our online smartphone course. Today we're going to learn how to download and install apps. Now, what are apps? Apps is short for applications. Um, and apps are basically all the squares that you see on your phone. Okay, this is an app, Roku, Music, YouTube. Um, some of the more famous apps that you know are apps like WhatsApp, Gmail, Facebook, Waze, um, and apps um, in, the, in those sort. Now, to download apps, we need to use the App Store, okay? It looks exactly like this on your phone, of course, if you have an iPhone. Um, and it says App Store on the bottom. Now, you should be able to find it by going, swiping right and left and looking for it. If you do not find it in uh, here, it could be that it's in a folder. Now, folders look like this. Notice how there's a bunch of little squares in each of these big squares, okay? Notice all these are um, folders. You can even see it says folder here. Um, some of these are folders that I made from before. Um, if you tap on one of these folders, just tap on it in the middle, okay? It opens a folder and you can swipe um, inside the folder. Now, notice how there's three small dots. That means that there's three pages. So watch, if I just go like this, swipe that way, one, two, three, okay? You see how there's three pages? How do I know that there's three pages? Because there's three small dots on the bottom. If I swipe to the to the right, the um, white dot will be in the middle. If I swipe again, the white dot, the dot will move to the right, okay? So that's a folder. So it could be that your app store is in a folder. In my case, it's not. It's just on the main screen. So um, I'm just going to go ahead and tap it. Now, just slight tap with your finger, just like a click of the mouse, and you'll be in the app store. Now, you don't have to be confused by all these things um, in when you open it. You What you need to do is just go to search. Okay, see on the bottom right, it says search. If I just tap on that, I can search, and I can search for any apps I want by noticing this square here where it says games, app stories, and more. If I tap on that, just tap on it, um, my uh, keyboard will come up, and I can tap anything I want. Let's say Facebook, okay? So I write down Facebook. Okay, and notice how there's a list of things that came up. I could just type on the first one that says Facebook. Just tap the word. And as you can see, um, here's Facebook. Now, why did Amazon come up? Notice that it says ad. You see that little thing right there that's ad? That means that it's an advertisement. Guys, always notice if it says ad. That means that it's probably not what you search for and somebody's trying to sell you a app. So this is Amazon paying to, to advertise this app. That is not what you search, searched for. You searched for Facebook. So you can go to Facebook and you can press download here. Okay, let's give you another example. Um, um, let's say this is an app that I want. Okay, let's just say that this is an app that I want to download. Notice how it says get here. If you just tap on get, it will start downloading. Now, notice how it says to double click to install right here, okay? What does that mean? It means that it wants you to press the physical button that turns off your phone on the right side of your um, phone. Um, on, the on the left side of the phone, you have the volume up and down, up and down button. And on the right, you have the, the button that turns off and on your phone. So it says to double click the um, button that, that's on the right of on the right side of your phone, you just double tap it, okay? As you were as as if you were going to turn off your phone twice, just double tap it and it starts downloading. Now, it could be that um, it will ask for a um, it could be that it will ask for your Apple ID and password, okay? Very important for you to know those two things. If you do not know those two things, you can ask um, a family member to help you reset it or you can try on your own. It's um, a pretty complicated thing to do. It, you can say reset password, um, or I forgot my password, uh, one, of, uh, one of those, and it will send you an email um, so, that you have, so that you can verify that it's you and not someone else trying to break into your account. And you can, from there, it will tell you how to make a new password and um, figure out how to resume your account. So. Um, I, I really recommend, 
uh, remembering all of your passwords, writing them down um, so that um, you can always remember them um, because these are examples of times where you're going to need your password when you need to download your app, okay? On the newer phones, it already uses your um, face recognition, but those of you that have, that have an older iPhone, um, it's going to ask for your password and your ID. Um, after downloading the app, it will be on your home page, okay? Probably on one of the bottom apps, okay? Um, look for them. They're, it won't be hard to find them. Uh, let's say Zoom is one of the apps that I downloaded lately. Um, that's it. It's, it's there. You can just tap on it and open it. Um, so, again, we go to the App Store. You can press on Search and look for the square up here. You can tap on it and you can start typing whatever you want. Um, or another way of finding apps is if you don't know exactly what the app's called or you want to see if there's an app that you want, you can go to Apps down here and you can just scroll through all the apps and look for an app that you want. Once you see an app that you want, you can press on Get and it will download the app and eventually be on your home screen. That's it for today, guys. Hope you enjoyed. See you guys later.